Hi beautiful souls, this is Arshna with Divine Soul Resonance welcoming you to my channel with all my heart. Thank you so much for all my new subscribers and absolutely big hugs and love to all my existing ones for all your love and support. So as a crystal healer, I've been asked constantly the properties and how crystals really help us so I've decided and they've asked this is by popular demand for the classes that I do and they say Arshana why don't you start creating videos about the crystals since I work with the chakra systems I am going to bring forth a whole series of videos for the seven chakras and beyond and the different crystals and stones we can use for harmonizing that chakra so I'll begin with the element of earth our first chakra which is at the root at the base of the spine the root chakra so root chakra is the chakra for safety stability our grounding on the earth on this material plane how do we view safety how do we view security what is our foundation so it's the foundational energy it is also the place where the kundalini energy resides it's a serpent line energy which is coiled and it sits there in the root chakra we want to do the chakra work in this in this video in this one i want to talk about a stone that i predominantly use for healing and it is red jasper i'm going to show this i pulled out a few look at this red jasper you see that? <laughs> this one looks a little bit orange, but it is red jasper. Natural stones. Okay. Red jasper, color red. So our root chakra is the color red, but the stones that are used for grounding are red in color. And also black actually I'm wearing black and red just to kind of put the colors together I'll also do a black stone one but today I want to focus on what red Jasper is and um, one of the books I highly recommend for many people and I absolutely love this is this particular book it is so detailed and it gives so many affirmations I mean look at the size of that one right so I'm going to read what Robert Simmons. This is by Robert Simmons and um, Naisha Ahsin said, I may not have said her name correctly. Um, I'll just read the key aspects of it because I think it's amazing on how they're written. So the element is the element of earth, like I said, and the chakra is the root chakra, the first chakra. And they also, because it's, it's right next to the second chakra, which is a sacral one. So it works with when you put energy in this one, it also affects the energy of the second one, which is our sacral chakra. So it says here, red jasper can help enhance one's endurance and stamina and can work over time to increase the amount of chi or the life force energy. Okay. In our energetic field, it strengthens the root chakra and our connection to the earth. So the frequency of red jasper opens and stimulates the base chakra and the energetic kundalini serpent that dwells at the base of the spine, just like what I'd mentioned. The rising of the serpentine energy up the spine is a powerful spiritual experience as it activates and clears and strengthens each of the chakras. So why the root chakra? It's our sense of foundation. So all our fears related to stability, of what we perceive as stability, material abundance, abundance in the world and how we live and connect in the earth resides in this chakra. So our belief systems, our patterns, our, our ways of thinking and how we do things, you know, those are our behavioral patterns all reside in this chakra. And it's not just the imprint of ours. It's also our ancestral, which we have carried down. And it, that's why it's called, what is the root? You know, we talk about, think about it. What is the root of the problem? Where are your roots? Where are you coming from? Unless you know where you're coming from, you're not going to know where you're going. So it's going back to the roots. So root chakra 
strengthening and cleansing the root chakra is very important it's like i'm sitting right next to a tree right now right it's in my backyard it's so strong because the roots are deep and connected into the earth into the physical reality into mother earth red jasper has that frequency has the frequency for our ability to connect in the physical plane it cleanses the toxicity the negative thought patterns the negative energetic imprints that we have lodged in our first chakra this is what we've lodged in the first chakra so from this particular um, activation deck and i've pulled out um, relevant cards this is the card of root chakra do you see that color is red from the flower of life sacred geometry and it says the frequency of root chakra the red flower of life it stimulates our passion and supports our sense of security on the physical plane both in our bodies as well as the physical world and i think they mentioned that here i highlighted that so red jasper helps in manifesting creative ideas it helps continue working on a project or an idea that has lost its original excitement and it stimulates the base chakra and so and supports the rising of the kundalini we talked about that it releases shame or guilt it's an ally for those who are determined to heal and recover from past abuses and traumas so it's a stone for physical strength and energy for those who need extra support to recover from physical illness yes it talks about that but as we're strengthening it you think about your day-to-day -day life so one of the ways in which you can bring this energy in is you can hold a red jasper it's very easily available you can go to any metaphysical stores go to a crystal store you want to get it online you get it online i'll talk about how to cleanse the I'll, I'll just do a different video for that and I'll just link it in here on how to keep the stones cleansed so anytime you're buying something from outside you can cleanse that out and you can use it so you can sit with this you can focus on you can hold the stones or one stone two stone doesn't matter let's do it one you can hold it I like to hold it and create like a heart and hold that in here whatever calls to you, you want to hold it like that that's completely okay take deep breaths in you connect with the energy of the stone when you still your mind and your energy body you'll start to feel the frequency of this it may take a few tries if you're not used to it you can sit with this and before or during this time Think about what safety means for you. Think about what it means to have a strong foundation. Don't judge. Let whatever comes forth come to the consciousness. And you can see where it's holding you down and where you need to work to release old patterns so you can bring wholeness to this chakra to bring wholeness to this chakra red jasper the frequency of root chakra allow the energy of red jasper to fill your soul your chakra system with life force energy which connects you directly to the energy of the earth to the physical plane to the plane where your dreams can be manifested so you can start a strong foundation wishing you much grounding wishing you much happiness and i will create posts on other crystals and how you can bring healing in through crystals sending you love and light Mwah.